I wanted to replace the flooring in this condo I was renovating. I started by cleaning the existing floor so that I wouldn't have any debris that would interfere with my installation. I also removed the old tiny baseboard so that I can install my new flooring up to the edges. I had received flooring from Malibu Wide Plank. It was the French Oak Menlo Park and I absolutely loved the color. I'm using it in a waterside condo and so this kind of sandy blonde color was perfect. I started by attaching spacers to the wall and then running my planks up to the spacers. I first removed the flooring from the boxes and took a look at the attached underlayment. It was nice and thick and saved me time from having to install any underlayment myself. The planks were a bit over 7 inches wide and 60 inches long. That's 5 foot long planks which made installation super quick and easy. Planks were installed with the groove side sticking out so that I could install new rows into the groove and click them into place. My favorite part of the flooring is actually how it fits together with the click and lock system. Just by holding the plank at around a 45 degree angle, I can get the tongue into the groove and slide it into place. If I have installed a plank wrong, I can immediately tell because it doesn't fit flat. So I just reset it and then it would go into the groove properly and lay flat. I love that it doesn't need a heavy hand at all. You don't need to be strong to install these floors at all, which works for me. In fact, if you start banging on it, you can really damage the flooring. So it was easy to place my plank in place, make sure the long side was properly engaged and lying flat, and sliding it up and next to the prior plank. Then I would press it down on this short side so that it would engage. Once it was engaged, I would use a rubber mallet to secure it only on the short side never banging on the long side. When I got to the end of a row, it was really easy to cut the flooring in place, which saved me from having to get up and down all the time to make cuts. Also, while installing the next rows, I would use the remaining cut piece from the end, so long as there was more than 7 inch variation between the seams. This helped my floor look better and also helps with the installation, since you don't really want the two rows of planks with the seams right next to each other. It's perfect for the beginner DIYer because of this easy installation. That's really all it took. In one day, I had the entire kitchen, living room, and hallway done. It's sturdy, but still soft underfoot, I think because of the underlayment. I don't worry at all about scratches or water, which is great when my puppies and I are coming in from a day out on the boat or they've been outside playing. Cleaning is easy, and I love that it's a low gloss matte finish. I absolutely love this flooring. Malibu Wide Plank sponsored this project and provided the French Oak Menlo Park flooring, but the opinions are absolutely my own. I love the flooring and encourage you to give it a try for your next DIY.